guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Stacy, and if you're new here, welcome. If you've been here before, welcome back. So, this video is gonna be me showing you guys how I install this 12 inch butterfly crochet extensions from Toyo Tress. I came across them on Instagram and I've also seen them on YouTube. I've seen a few YouTubers install these and they always looked cute. So I went on their Instagram one day and I saw where they said, if you wanted to try these butterfly logs, DM us. So I went ahead and I just shook, I shoot my shot and they replied that same night right away and sent me within two days i received this toyo tress hair and i've just been so i've been itching to get this in i've been just dying to install it because i've actually wanted this hairstyle for a while now i wanted it since these first became popular i think that was last year summer i've been dying to try these like let me tell y'all i was on youtube constantly go um trying to see how they i know a lot of persons they do it individually and girl i just was not about that life i just i just couldn't do it i even looked to getting it done by some persons locally but didn't quite find anyone who did it exactly like how i liked it or in the price range that i could afford so when i saw these were in the crochet style and with toyo trust they are girl they are so cheap these are so easy to um these are so affordable and they are so easy to install you'll see if you keep watching this video you will see how i installed it and it came out so cute i love it i absolutely love it this is exactly how i imagined it would look so stay tuned if you want to see how i did it Okay, so now I'm gonna start crocheting the butterfly locks into my hair and let me just show y'all how it came. So this is the butterfly locks hair extensions from Toyo Trash and this is how it comes. It comes in a pack and this is the 12 inch 1B Toyo Trash. So it comes like this in this full big package. Two, three, four, five, six, seven eight so it's eight of these individual packs and i don't know how much is on the inside but this is a lot of hair i think this will be enough so this is all the hair so and it is a lot so this is definitely going to be enough and if it's not i'm going to make it enough because this is a lot i don't want i don't want my hair to be too big oh this shirt is going to get on my nerve i hate these kind of shirts why did I wear this? So anyway, I already got my hair braided. I had a friend braid it because I am not too good. I'm, no, actually, I'm lazy. I can do it because I did do it before. I do have a video where I did um, crochet locks before. Oh, actually, before I continue, it also comes with a crochet hook or tool, whatever you call it comes with two tools so this is to install crochet and i think this is when the like if it unravels this helps it to i, I can't remember the exact terms for the use but i know what this is i see this before i've seen like stylists who do lock extension i've seen them use this to kind of like get the dreads get the locks like i'm gonna find the right terms for this let me see this is here okay no it's not on here but this is just a little card a little thank you card that they send these tools and a pack of hair so that's what i got i'm gonna start to install them now and as i said before i already got it braided i had my friend do it for me and if you need to see how it's actually done i do have a video that i already did with crochet um install i think what was that that was like passion twist i had before so i'm gonna link it below if you want to see like detailed on how i did the braiding pattern but it's very similar these are a little bit bigger and whatever it's fine i just want to get these in so it doesn't have to be perfect Ooh. So this is how they come out of the pack. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So it's ten per pack, per bundle, or whatever you call it. And they're soft. Wow, they feel soft and silky. I thought they were gonna be like hard 
and like you know how like they get hard and they like kind of like stiff and stick off but no these are really soft so i'm gonna start by installing the first one i think i'm gonna start from the front of my head okay so this is how it looks so i'm just gonna start from the front should i do it Y'all, where am I? It's so noisy. So if y'all hear stuff, there's nothing I can do about it. <laughs> okay, so the part that you pull through your plait is definitely more thicker. So it's a little bit, little, just a little bit harder to get through. And of course, the whole thing is like distressed and all that. So... I, I already see this is gonna take me a little time. It's not gonna move as fast as the passion twist one. But I got the first one in. All right, that was easy. So I'm gonna do the front first and then I'll go ahead and do the back. So the reason why I did my plaits, like I did my braids, my braiding pattern like this, was because I um, I wanted to kind of give the illusion of the that they are individual butterfly locks. So yeah, that's the whole point for having spaces in between. I can't see what I'm doing. I need a mirror. There's a mirror way over there. I just don't know where I'm gonna put it. And this shirt is annoying. Why is this shirt annoying? Okay, so I'm just going to continue to install these locks. I'm basically going to go and install in every block. So I'm going to do the front first and then I'll be back. Okay, so this is one pack. This is 10 butterfly locks in my hair already. So this is already one pack. So I, at this point, I'm not even sure if I'm gonna be using all of them, but this is one so far. So I'm gonna continue with the rest of the butterfly locks. Okay, so I'm almost done. I just have this section, this section to finish, and I am down. Like, my head is so big. I thought I wasn't going to use all eight packs, but I only have two more packs left. And I have to fill up this whole section in the back here. Like, my hair is so huge. But so far, I am loving it. I'm liking how it is looking, so I can't wait till I'm done. I'll be back when I'm done, y'all. We almost there. And I think I've been here for like 30 something minutes now. So it doesn't take that long to install the crochet part. Thank God. Okay, guys. So I'm back. And this is how we are looking. I'm just checking to see. 
I'm just checking to see if I should add any more, if I have any spaces, but for the most part, for the most part, this is how we look it in the back. For the most part, I'm, I'm loving it. I was taught, I actually filmed another video while finishing this, so I didn't even realize I was done. And I managed to get seven bundles in my hair. I still have one more pack. But I don't know if I'm going to put that in because I don't want this to be too thick. I y'all my head big. And usually when I do styles, like these styles tend to make my head look even bigger. So I'm just going to put this fill in these two spots that I feel a little space in. And then I'm going to be done. Okay, so I'm done with installing and I love it. It is so cute. I'm going to put these in. Just to add some little accessories, some little bling. These are just some, what do you call these things? Hair accessories. Y'all, this looks so cute. Okay, so I always have a problem figuring out where to put stuff like these. So I think I'm gonna put one. I think I'm gonna put one right here. Like how obvious, right? Okay, that's cute. So let's put one. This is the final look, y'all. Thanks so much for watching my video. And if you like this and would love to see more, make sure to subscribe to my channel. You can also do me a favor and share and like and comment so that more persons can get to see my content. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.